Okay, so just updated to iOS 7 about 24 hours ago. So I do uh, have a glitch that I noticed, and it wasn't until actually uh, this morning when I noticed it. Um, I was browsing the web and everything on my Wi-Fi uh, for about an hour and a half. Then when I go to sleep, you know, I put the phone away. About eight hours later when I wake up, it's used about 25% of my battery for who knows what. It was killed a quarter of my battery in that eight hours I was asleep doing nothing. Um, so I was looking through some stuff. Um, when I went into my settings here, under general and usage, I do remember it said, you know, an hour and a half under usage. Uh, before I put it away and then when I looked at it again when I woke up these were just two dash marks it completely wiped out the usage in standby time so and I didn't plug it in since then usually those marks would come up if you plug it in again or something like that but um, it totally erased my times so I couldn't figure out exactly how long this thing was active for uh, another glitch I just kind of figured out today actually was that um, when I go into my messages uh, I have only one text message here from somebody you know you can swipe to the left to uh, delete well when I swipe to the left it just keeps going back So it does that with all my messages. You can still delete them. You just have to make sure you hit the delete button, you know, before it goes away. Um, I've only had, you know, iOS has been out for probably about 24 hours or so. And uh, when I first updated, I never actually had this issue. It wasn't until uh, when I woke up this morning, you know, I seen this issue all last night and all yesterday when I was using iOS 7 I didn't have this this is just something that came up right now I even restored uh, iOS 7 and you know restored from a backup and uh, it's still doing this and it's not just in my text it's in a lot of things that uh, use that same function such as email so there's my email accounts right here let's say I'll go to uh, my hotmail account Okay, if I want to do that for an email, I'll swipe, and it just goes away. And you can look at the top up here in the corner, where it says done, it just keeps flickering and flashing. It'll just do that forever. I can click done, and it'll, it'll stop. Everything is like that. Also, if I just want to uh, go ahead and click edit, and if I want to select emails to delete, well, I can click it, but it'll do the same thing. It'll unselect itself. And this is for, you know, all my email accounts. I'll do exchange. Same thing. Let's go to edit. So this has been probably the most noticeable bug I've seen about iOS 7. Uh, a lot of other stuff has just been kind of small, not really big stuff. But again, like I said, when I first updated to iOS 7, that was not a problem that was happening. It wasn't until this morning that I actually noticed <clears throat> it was actually having a problem. <clears throat> Um, aside from that, I don't know what was consuming so much battery. Um, I've heard from other things online that uh, uh, the iPhone 5 was having some battery performance issues when updating to iOS 7. And uh, all day yesterday when I was using it, battery performance seemed to be just about as the same as when it was on iOS 6. Except for overnight, somehow it killed 25% of my battery. 
Uh, there's no applications running in the background or anything, so I don't know what that was about. But uh, if you've seen anything, uh, let me know. I'm kind of curious to see if this is just an issue that I've had myself or if it's a, a widespread issue.